Waste another day, eyes on my display You say we need a change and I feel that you mean it You mean it But you're so right, we're losing track of time Buying things online and it's not like we need them We don't need them so can we just slow down? Alright guys, I'm basically done getting ready for today's morning session. Um, I'm gonna skip out on a big breakfast. I'm just gonna have a little fruit or something with some supplements. Uh, I like it that way better, so I'm feeling my best at my training session. But um, I just wanna show you guys the gear we got a little bit. So here is the North Texas gear. Sure looks kinda cool. Shorts. And then they got us some socks as well. So just a basic gear here. Hopefully we get to keep it. Um, that'd be pretty cool if we get to keep it. But yeah, I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of my morning routine. I'm gonna tour you guys around my place a little bit and then we're gonna go to training session. I wanted to add guys, I do these stretches every single morning and I'm really happy that I added this into my morning routine because once I go to training, I'm not gonna need the extra five, 10 minutes to you know, get into the session. Hopefully my touch is good and my body can move wherever I need to. Now I'm gonna pack up the rest of my stuff, give you guys a little house tour and we'll go to training. Okay, so we'll start off coming in. Here's the kitchen, nice little island here. Stove, everything, fridge. Everything looks pretty cool. And here's Derek's room and the spare bathroom here. And then here's the living room area. Xbox set up, pretty clean. Not too much going on. Nothing all over the walls, just basic room. Nice apartment. And then there's a nice little back hallway here that you can go through. And then up into my room. Here's my room, I have my setup here, my extra soccer stuff. Here I have my table, you know, lots of water. Got some trick or treat candy, Bible. I like to have that everywhere I go. Computer's charging, bed is made. All oh, bed's always made 24 seven guys. Gotta keep a clean bed. Oh yeah, let me show you this window outside. 
turn the window. Then my bathroom is a nice spot. My bathroom is pretty cool. I got two sinks. So I can choose whichever one to brush my teeth in. Ha! But yeah. I think they were having a party in here a while ago. They still got balloons and confetti in there. So I have a little jacuzzi tub and a shower. And then I got myself a walk-in closet that I'm probably never gonna use. So it's pretty dope, pretty cool. On my way to training, let's go. I've arrived at the facility. Now I'm just gonna go into the locker room, get ready for training session, and hopefully today, day two is a good one. So let's get it. You think we can? Well, yeah. Here? We're all the way to the right more. What's up? Is through here good? Yeah. Yeah. These pitches are immaculate, bro. Look at this water boys and shit. <laughs> so I think the first team players are gonna be training over there on field eight, I think. And then we're gonna be training right here on field six. I'm telling you, the grass is unbelievable and no excuse for a bad touch. All right, I'm gonna get ready. I'm gonna get warm. I'm out here early with Jacob and we're just gonna get some touches in before training starts. So we have a good training session. So I'm gonna catch up with you guys after. All right guys, I'm back now in my apartment. Training has just been done and it was tough. A lot of running, a lot of dropping and pressing. And you know, I had to show them what I can do. I had to show them the type of player I am. I can run up and down, I'm fit, but it did take a toll on me. I'm tired today. My legs are absolutely sore. So I'm gonna go back, do a little recovery, stretch for like an hour, and then, you know, continue with the rest of my day. All right guys, so for food, they gave us some pasta and stuff. Okay. They give us some pasta so we can eat. And this is how it looks right here. So unless the pasta with chicken, I'm pretty sure. And there's some greens there. I'm gonna top it off and make some eggs as well and eat it as my dinner. I'm gonna save it for later. I had a lot of fruits and I had some salads and vegetables. So that's gonna keep me well for lunch until dinner time. So I'll save this for them. What I am gonna have right now though is some body lean protein. And this is just really good. So it supports my lean muscle mass and it just keeps me healthy and keeps me ready for training sessions all the time. But yeah guys, that's basically it for today. Um, pretty long day, long session. Uh, very tough but you know it was good and it feels good to be training with the pros and be living like a pro this is something that i've always wanted and i feel like i'm doing exceptionally well i feel like i'm fitting in just perfectly fine and i just gotta keep going as the days progress i gotta progress i gotta get better and better and i gotta make sure that i'm not average that's one thing coach was saying that he doesn't want players to just be average and fit in he wants them to be extraordinary he wants he wants us trialists to step out of our comfort zone and show them something so that's something that i'm really working on and I feel like I'm doing pretty good, scoring some goals in training, getting some assist in, defending very well. And my work rate is really up there. So that's very good. So right now I'm just going to watch a movie, hang out for a bit. And before that, I'm going to answer some of you guys' questions. So I'm going to shop a little bit, answer some questions. If 
from you guys and then that's gonna be it for today's video so I'm gonna see you guys in a bit all right now that I'm all cleaned up and I've got my luncheon for the day I'm just gonna answer a few questions from you guys and then end off the vlog like that so question number one what type of diet do you eat to stay healthy and have muscles as a soccer player this is from Dylan Padilla Castillo um, personally my diet um, I try not to eat like I don't eat really early on in the mornings I kind of do this intermittent fasting so I'll start eating around like 1 to 2 and after 1 to 2 I'll eat like a nice light snack around 3 4 and then eat a dinner so it's it's not as much food as you know a lot of people say you should eat every day three big meals um, I like to just have two and then a little snack but for me personally it works it makes me feel really good and I can compete at the level that I need to and I'll stick with a lot of vegetables fruits and you know bread rice pasta chicken stuff like that um, I try to stay away from candy as much possible and like all the junk foods and stuff chick-fil-a and everything but once in a while I'll go and treat myself all right question number two from Ryan Flores how does it feel playing in a pro environment and being around players who are just as determined as you are to achieve your goals um, personally, bro, it's sick. Uh, I think it's amazing. I love being at the professional level training with them. Uh, it's making me better and it's getting me up to par very quickly. One thing about these players is everything's very fast paced and you know, they're very determined and you can even just tell that you know, they want to win every single drill, every single training session, every two touch game. And it's just like the level is so high and that's what it is to become a uh, professional. You know, nothing's easy. One thing that was quite different was in trainings you know, fouls and everyone's getting kicked down and stuff. You know, they don't call anything, you just play on. It's very competitive and honestly, that's the way I like it. I feel like I've been doing very well in the environment. I've, been, I've scored a few goals in training, assisted, and you know, my, my work rate is up there just with them, if not even higher. So I'm enjoying it and I love it when pro players around me pushing me, challenging me to be better, you know? So I like it, everything's going very well and thank you. Uh, question number three, this is from Tenny. Okunseri, what did you bring with you on trial? So honestly, I just brought my camera gear, uh, brought some clothes, and cones, uh, bands, soccer ball, and a Bible, and myself. So that's basically all I brought. Essentials, only things I really need. Um, I didn't really bring my gaming system, PS5. I didn't bring any of that stuff. Um, no TV or anything. I have my laptop just to you know do some homework and stuff. But other than that, I didn't bring anything too crazy. Just the basic fundamentals so I can go out and play very well. All right, question number four from uh, Eman for real. Is it nice having a girlfriend in the same industry as you? Oh hell no! Oh, I'm just kidding. Yeah, man, it's cool. Uh, yeah, she plays soccer in the women's team at Utah JV. Uh, we challenge each other every single day. We're very competitive and we just want to make sure that we're pushing each other to become better all the time. So it's cool. Uh, she's athletic, which is nice. I can go on runs with her and stuff like that. I can work out with her. So it's always nice to have. And the last question here from Milos Bisenik. What is more important for D1 college, grades or soccer knowledge? Honestly, you need both. In order for you to even have a soccer knowledge to play soccer, you need good grades. So you gotta make sure you're maintaining both and you're balancing both the best you can. You can't just be like, oh, I'm gonna focus slowly on soccer, no school. It's not gonna work out because if you start failing grades, you won't be able to play, you get suspended, and that's never good. So make sure you take care of both. Both have to be 100%. Those have to be your main two priorities. All right, guys, that's it for the video. Thank you so much for tuning in. I'm going to try to do, you know, this comments often. Uh, it's something that I want to try doing in every single video. But yeah, I'm enjoying it. Everything's going well here. Uh, thank you so much for watching this video. Again, make sure you like, subscribe. Make sure you guys are staying determined, driven, and disciplined in your goals every single day. William Mackios out. Peace. Hello.